guys it's amanda it's time for the big box giveaway i'm so excited guys i could literally fit nothing else in that box and i'll probably have to even get a bigger box to ship it in so the first thing is the oh so real mini packs from shopkins and then you have a make your own slime kit rainbow slimy gloop galaxy slimy gloop a pink foam baby shark tin that has a bunch of little surprises in it you have a poopsie uh, unicorn crush surprise um lucky fortune four a uh, four pack this num nums snackables pizza kit sorry my dog's growling guys he growls every time a shadow goes by the door this candy locks pick me pops two squish delish a blooms doll of awesome blossoms i do have two of these uh one of these a piece to do a video on later surprise toy box a zoobaloos we have two of these little um shopkins little secrets we have four of these little mashems lion kings two pop teenies um we have a num nums surprise in a bottle Four Zero Smashers Series Two. We have a pet, sh a little pet shop Lucky Pets. We have two of these um, Pick Me Pop Surprise Bubble Drops Neon Series and two Royal Hatches. Another one's around here somewhere. Two Royal Hatches, and then we have a Bot Bots, and then we have a Bebitos. We have three of these Num Nums lip glosses. And then we have a two Moj Moj. Mo, yeah, Moj Moj, I think that's right. Two little big bites. I'm trying to make sure. I think that's it. I think that's everything. Oh, I don't th think I showed you. And I found one of these. In my, there was only one of these that I can find. I can't find anymore, so these must sell. So these real littles. I got a pack of that. So, guys, this is quite a big giveaway. Probably, I'm going to say at least $100 worth, if not more, um, I've spent on this. Guys, I want to leave this up for two weeks so everybody gets a great chance at this. I'm going to pause this video. I'm going to put everything back in the box, and then I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Before I start, I want to do a big thank you. And I will show her name. Try to show the best I can without knocking the. Sorry, it's sideways. <laughs> without knocking the camera over. Um, Rebecca, Dice, Dice, Dice. Correct me, uh, Rebecca, which name is right. Um, she done the new artwork for my icon. Thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. You have been so great and amazing. Um, I can never thank you enough for as amazing as you have been. And then I want to give a shout out to a new subscriber, Rainbow Elf for Kids. And they do have a channel. Go check that channel out, guys, and subscribe if you want to. Um, I just want to give a shout out to all you guys. I want to thank you so much. And that's why I'm doing this big giveaway. I appreciate you guys so much. And my dog is barking every time a shout out goes by. Hold on just a minute, guys. Okay, guys, I'm sorry. My little dog is so schooled, he will not go out of the room because I'm in here. But every little shadow that goes by, he barks at. So I had to block the underneath of the door so he'd quit barking and growling. So, okay, sorry about that. I'm going to do a little bit different video today. I'm going to review some slime. Now, in the next video, I will be mixing all these slimes together. So, stay tuned for that. That's going to be fun. But, guys, um, before my dog rudely interrupted, thank you, Rebecca, so much for this new artwork. It's so pretty. And thank you guys so much. And if you want a shout-out, please let me know in the comments. I don't mind a bit. Um, everybody that watches me, I watch back 100%. And I enjoy thoroughly. Oh, excuse me. I had to yawn. 
But for the giveaway, guys, this is a really big giveaway. It will be up for two weeks, so everybody will have a good shot at it. So follow all the rules in the description and all the directions. And there will be a secret word hidden in here somewhere. Okay, I don't know which one I want to try first. Let's go for the candy scented one first. I think these all are scented except for one. This is candy flavored. Candy flavored. Guys, this is not flavored. Do not eat this. <laughs> Do not eat this slime. I don't know why I said flavored. This is candy scented slime. And we have uh, gummy bears, grape fizz, bubble gum, jelly beans, and lemon drops. I'm going to get this out of the package and be right back. Okay, guys, I got them all the package and put the angle down so you guys can see. I've got to open this one first because it says gummy bears and it's got like little gummy bears in it. Or it's not really gummy. Oh, I'm sorry. This is jelly beans. Where's the gummy bear ones? Yeah, the gummy bear ones has little gummy bears in it. But this has little jelly beans in it, guys. And this is um, from Compound Kings, which makes really good slime in my opinion. Guys, I've lost my scissors somewhere. Oh, there they are. They were in the box of toys I just put up. Guys, that box is so full. And I have an LOL box that is just as full for my next giveaway. I'm excited about that. There's, guys, the thing was down in it, that little stopper. Oh, okay, it's got the little, to keep these separated, the little jelly beans separated. And the reason I'm going to mix these in a different video is because of um, time. Because this is going to be a long video anyways, because I do have a lot of slime to review. And I may just uh, review two of them in this video and two of them in the next video. That's probably what I will do. I'll probably do this one, the candy one, and um, the ice cream one in this video, and do the tie-dye and the swirls in the next one, and then mix them in one. So here we have clear slime that's got like little jelly beans in it, like it looks just like jelly beans. It's just little plastic pieces. I'm trying to get one out. It's just a piece of plastic is all it is, but it's still super neat. I want to smell it. Guys, this, I thought this was the one that said it was scented, but let me get the box. Yeah, it says scented on it, but I do not smell anything. I mean, absolutely no smell whatsoever. But this is a really good slime. I could play with this forever. The only thing I hate about clear slime is it gets so dirty looking once you play with it for a while. That's why I'd rather have like a little bit of color to it. Oops, I dropped one of my jelly beans. Sorry for breathing in the speaker like that, guys. That was probably very awkward. Okay. I do have some uh, makeup to put in some slime I, because I've been wanting to branch out in slime videos for a while, but I've just had so many toys to open and I enjoy it so much. I enjoy both of it though. <laughs> so funny. I really loved when Britt was here. I like teasing her with that when it made that noise. Okay, let's go ahead and open the gummy bears since it's going to be probably pretty similar to the jelly bean. Hopefully it really does smell though because that one didn't really have a a smell to it. And it does have little um, gummy bears in it. I'm going to get one of these out. And these are not plastic. These are more of, um, I'm trying to focus. These are more of like a rubbery feel. But there's, oh, there's two connected together. They're like molded together and there's like. Um, a darker green one, lighter green, and a pink one. Oh, I see. They tried to make it to where, um, I think they're, they're supposed to be separated, but these are like stuck together. There we go. I got them apart. And this is the same kind of slime. 
as the the jelly bean one. Same exact texture. No smell. Maybe the other ones smell. Maybe these two don't smell because I'm very confused. It's the same exact slime. I do like the feel of the these better than the jelly beans because the jelly beans things were hard plastic and they would just fall out. But these are kind of very squishy. It seems like maybe this slime's a little bit different. It seems like it's not. Well, there it goes. Maybe I just have to play with it more. Yeah, just have to play with it a little bit more. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, let's go ahead and open lemon drops. Let's hope this smells good, guys, because I thought these were scented. They're supposed to be scented, I know that. Oh, yes. Oh, my goodness, guys. This smells so good. Not a food. Do not eat. Oh, my, I, I could eat this. But don't. Oh, my gosh. It smells like fresh lemonade. Oh, my goodness. And that this is a, like a texture. I've not, it's like wet. It feels wet. It's like a texture I've never felt. It's so weird. It does feel like... Oh my gosh, that smell is amazing. I'm going to hate mixing these slimes. I might buy some to not mix to keep. <laughs> because, oh my goodness, look how amazing that is. This might be my favorite so far anyways. We have two more. Oh my, that smell. Guys, I am in love with that smell. And this texture is like... It's like, looks like it's got little pieces of sugar in it. And it's kind of like the cotton candy, but a little bit more, um, a little bit more wet feel to it. And it still makes the noise. <laughs> Not as much, but oh my, I gotta, I keep smelling it, guys. I'm sorry if you hear me. It smells on my hands now. I gotta try to wipe it off so that we can smell these other ones. I'm and these are the scented ones. The jelly bean and the gummy bear one was just textured ones. This is bubble gum. Yes, smells just like bubble gum. I don't want to get the lemon scent mixed in the bubble gum, but it's probably going to happen. Oh my gosh, guys. Do you remember that bubble type bubble gum? That's what this smells like. And this is the same exact texture as the lemon drops. It's, guys, it's like a cotton candy slime, but it's so much more wet. But I like it. I mean, it's not messy wet, but it is got like a wet feel to it. You know how like the cotton candy slime is normally more dry? You, I figured the bubblegum slime would be fluffy slime because fluffy slime kind of looks like chewed bubblegum. This smells good, but the lemon is my favorite smell so, so far. Oh my goodness, that smelled. The lemon is definitely my favorite so far. Grape Fizz. Let's get this out of here. Oh my goodness, this smells good too. And a lot of you guys probably might not like this smell if you didn't like that grape medicine we had to take as kids. I actually liked the flavor of the grape medicine. I know I'm weird. <laughs> but that's kind of what it smells like is that grape medicine you would get as a kid, like the grape flavored Tylenol liquid. Guys, and remember this is not food. Don't eat it. It's not flavored. I don't know why I said that at first. And this is just cotton candy slime, but guys, I'm, it's so weird. I've never, this is the first time I've felt a cotton candy slime that has been this. I like this better because it doesn't crumble and fall apart. Ooh, that smells good. I like the lemon best so far, though, because it smells just like fresh lemonade. But this is my second favorite. The bubble gum's okay, but it's just not like a really strong 
smell. I'm going to pause and get the ice cream slimes out, which is also scented. And we have um, cookie dough, chocolate chip mint, Rocky Road strawberry, and cookies and cream. Okay, guys, I'm doing something different with the secret word this time. I'm going to say put hashtag and put whatever word you want to put. But I want you to look through the comments and make sure it's different from everybody else's. And don't, don't put that in the comments if this is how it is. That way we know that the people that are entering this giveaway are doing what they're supposed to do. And I will know who puts it first because it's got a time stamp on it. So don't worry about that. But I, I'm going to try this. Just put hashtag whatever word you want to. You can put hashtag ice cream, hashtag hi, hashtag you can leave a, an emoji, whatever. Actually, probably not emoji. I've learned that leaving emojis can actually put your um, comments in spam. I don't know why that is, but it does happen that way. But let's try this for this video and see how that works. And um, so this giveaway will be up for two weeks. So put hashtag whatever word you want to, but look through the comments right quick and uh, make sure you put a totally different word than everybody else. But let's see how that works. And tell me if you think that's a good idea or if it's awful of me. I just, I feel like it's unfair to the people that really watch the whole video. Okay, this is the strawberry. This smells just like the bubble gum, guys. Exactly like it. And it's exactly the same slime. So I'm not even gonna... It's exactly the same thing as the bubble gum. It smells... It has a little bit more of a strawberry smell, but almost exactly the same. Let's try the cookie dough. I figured it would have little chocolate chips in it, guys, so I'm disappointed. I wish it had chocolate chips in it. This basically is all that wet. The ice cream slime is all, and the candy slime, except for the, oh my gosh, I might have a new favorite smell. This does not smell like cookie dough. This smells like mangoes. I don't even like to eat mangoes, but the smell, this is my new favorite smell. This smells like, why? it say cookie dough? Why didn't it just say mango ice cream or something? This smells just like mangoes. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. And it's the same texture as the other ones, the wet, fluffy, cotton candy stuff. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. Oh, and one more thing, leave the uh, words you leave respectful, though. Like, don't put nothing bad. I know you guys won't, but just putting that out there. Okay, let's try probably my least favorite ice cream flavor, which is probably chocolate chip mint. My uh, son loves it, though. And this one does have little chocolate chips in it. So we're going to have to be real careful not to spill those everywhere, which is probably going to happen. I'm just going to try to dump them. Oh, these are messy. These are crumbly, guys. These are little crumbled up uh, rubber pieces. These are going to get everywhere. Yep. As I predicted. I don't know if I like the feeling of that. If it, Look at that. It's separated a little bit at the bottom. And this, oh my gosh, it smells good though. It smells like toothpaste. I love toothpaste, guys. I could brush my teeth all day long. I love the taste of toothpaste. That's what it smells like is toothpaste. I don't know if I like that texture you guys might like it, like, if you like to feel like little crumbly. It feels like your slime has got dirt in it, basically. That's what it feels like to me. I'm not much on the texture, but the smell is amazing. My favorite still is the mango, but 
I absolutely love mint smell. I don't like chocolate in my mint, though, which is weird. I can't say that because I like peppermint patties every now and then, but the ice cream, not so much, but my son loves it. What is your favorite flavor ice cream? You can put that as your hashtag if you want to. Put hashtag your favorite color or favorite type of ice cream. Okay, let's go ahead and try Rocky Road. That is one of my favorites. Oh, we got little, um, like foam beads, like marshmallows. And they're going absolutely everywhere. I'm going to try to pour them in my hand for a minute and then put them right there until we get the slime out. Oh, them foam beads are going everywhere. You guys see them rolling? Oh my gosh, that smells like pure chocolate. I'm trying to catch all these beads. <laughs> the static is making them go everywhere. Some of them rolled in the floor. We saved what we could. Now, the only thing I have to complain about that is, you probably can't see it, but like the... The coloring is coming off of it quite a bit. Oh my gosh, it smells just like hot chocolate. That's what it smells like, hot chocolate. Which I just fixed my son some while ago because his throat was sore and that smells just like it. And this is a different texture. This is more of just like a regular wet, good stretchy slime. I really like this one. This might be my second favorite smell. I don't know. Probably mango, lemon, then this one, then the toothpaste smelling one. Okay, we have one more, which is cookies and cream. And we don't have any cookies in here. Guys, I don't know why they do that. They should have just called it cream. What? Some of them, they have stuff in them. I really don't understand the cookie dough smelling like mango. That should have just been mango ice cream. I don't understand that at all. I'm really not wanting to get that brown color on this pretty white slime. I'm trying to figure out what this cookies and cream smells like. It definitely is scented, but I cannot figure the scent out for nothing. It smells like um, sugar cookie dough. It smells, yeah, it smells just like sugar cookie dough, or if you get like those sugar cookie tart. Burner, burning things like you burn in those um, little candle warmers. And this is the cotton candy um, wet slime. Okay, let's see. This one's my favorite smell. This one's my second favorite smell, third favorite, fourth favorite. Um, fifth favorite, okay, first favorite is this one, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and then seventh and eighth because they smell just a lot, and these don't even smell, so, but probably my favorite textures are these. I really like clear slime, the feel of them. Guys, tell me what your favorite one would be. I know you can't smell them, but like, what was your favorite, like, consistency and all that? And remember, leave, this is a big giveaway. So leave um, an extra special, unique to you word in the comments. Guys, uh, I have a super big LOL giveaway coming up after this giveaway gets over with. I will be, in the next video, I will be uh, reviewing the swirl slime. It is not scented, but it's got different things to swirl in it. And then this one is scented, and it's tie-dye fluffy cloud. So I'm guessing this one looks a little bit more like the cotton candy slime than the ones we felt today, which was more of a wet consistency. And then after that, I will be mixing them all together and see what color we get and what consistency, and I'm very excited. I love you guys so much. Thank you for sticking with me. Bye.